I had a football wherever I went really. You'd be struggling to find an area of the farm that I haven't held a footy in. I'm Tom Hawkins and I'm on my family farm at Springfield in New South Wales. Uh, this is where I grew up. I love coming back, it's, it's awesome. It's such a release and a great release from, from playing football. I was a really active kid. I love getting out and, and just being in the open space, whether it was jumping on a motorbike. I really loved spending time with Dad and, and there was just always something happening. Tom would arrive after school and his priorities were to drop his bags, to eat and then to grab a football and to come over and see what was happening in the yards. Father would be up to his ears in drafting something and Tom would be about 30 metres from where he was meant to be and he'd start kicking the football. Mum's uncles played and Dad's two brothers played games of football with Geelong and, and then obviously Dad. I certainly had a love of agriculture and that was uh, my destiny and the footy came along on the way, uh, on the way through. Because Tom's gone on and uh, um, done what he's done, um, people want to talk about footy. It is a really important part of small communities, the sport and in particular football, it's an important part of their life. Football clubs are the, are the lifeblood of the community and, and I feel like uh, I've got a great base of, of, of skill development and that really comes from kicking the football around the farm with family and friends. Well the wool shed over here, it has quite wide double doors, then it became a bit of a challenge to kick the ball through the doors. And then when that was mastered, there's a vent in the, in the high up in the roofing and then that became the challenge to try and kick the footy through that hole and that used to take up a lot of time. When I, as a forward, ha having a shot at goal, I try and pick something out behind the goal. So the fundamentals of kicking through the hole in the shed and the goal posts on the field are, are still very much the same. So I would say that I have learnt um, and developed my skill uh, here. When he would be on the MCG and the pressure would be on, I would think, oh, I don't know how you're going to go, but you've still had a lot of practice. <laughs> <laughs>